This is a whole new twist to our adventure videos. Dyla have sent us a mystery box. We have no idea what's in it, but apparently there's a list of challenges that we have to work our way through. If we fail the challenges, oh, yep. there's penalties involved. <laughs> Once we open this box, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be excited or nervous. This is a Dyla mystery box challenge. What do you think? Oh, this is gonna be really fun. Challenge number four. Catch a legal sized kingfish on top water gear using the new Daiwa BG MQ Arc and one of the provided Daiwa stick baits. Really? Okay, what do we got? Two. Right, oh, it's two. Yeah, and there's another one. Oh, there's three. Three stick baits. Oh my goodness. All right, so we got two of these shore spartans, which I've actually used these before and we've done really well on them so i know for a fact they catch kingies what's the other one? Oh, yeah big salt eagle lure okay so i'm feeling pretty good we've got some good lures so yeah. that's a good start but what do we got here as far as real bg mq 18,000 arc okay do you want to open it yeah nude <laughs> nude are you ready oh yep yeah, okay sorry i'm getting distracted by the nude lures yes you are all right <laughs> oh nice that's nice bit of gold all right what's the real like shiny oh it's sweet <laughs> Oh. Yeah, that's real nice. Spooled up too. Good oh. to see you boys spooled it up for me. Hmm. Nice. That is actually really nice, guys. Look oh, at that. Wow. So that's challenge number four. Catch a kingfish, a legal kingfish on top water. Product one times BGMQ 18,000 arc. One times Saltiga, 100 pound braid, a Saltiga dive style lure, and we've got two shore Spartan lures. Someone could be taking home that whole combo. Pretty cool opportunity to get yourself a pretty sweet little combo. You like the look of it? Yeah. Does look good, eh? Yeah, look at the lovely gold. The catch. For every challenge you don't pass, you have to eat a spoonful of the provided wasabi. Wasabi! <laughs> what? Let's do it! Alright. Alright guys, so the rod we're going to put this reel on is the Spartan S80 5-8. This is actually Catherine's rod. This is her favourite rod, so... Do you mind that I'm using it? It's all right. I'm sure you'll look after it. Let's hope so. Next time you see us, we're going to be heading down to the ledge. Actually, where should we go? On episode one of this challenge, we actually saw a lot of kingfish. I wonder if we should go to that ledge. I think that's a good it's idea. probably a good place to start if we're trying to find a kingfish. So it, that feels nice. Tie the lure on and we're ready to go, guys. There is no way I want to lose this challenge. <sighs> Top of the hill, guys. <sighs> There's quite a good ledge down here we're going to fish. I've got the lure tied on. Everything is as you get it in the box. All I've done to it is I've flattened the barbs down just for safety for me and for the fish if they end up reefing me. That hook will come out a lot easier because it's got no barbs. As long as I can keep the tension on, we should be good. BG MQ Arc Reel. Let's go. You pumped? Oh yeah. Catherine's going to try to get us some dinner as well. <gasps> oh. So we're going to have a cook up later on, hopefully at camp. That's the plan guys, let's see what happens. But this ledge here, we fished this on episode one, as you probably remember. We saw a lot of kingies come past. Fingers crossed it happens again. It seems like a good time for them now. Yeah, pretty steep though. Just got to be careful as we go down here. There is a quick way to get down. <laughs> Not all want to do it. Have you guys that haven't seen or caught a kingfish before, they pull extremely hard. If you run enough drag, you can fully get pulled in by them. That's how powerful they are. So, they're amazing to catch. They're so, so good to catch. Huge adrenaline rush, eh? Hopefully we can find the biggest one in the ocean this evening. All right, take my pack up here. Sorry, Catherine, just gave, gave her a punch. We're a little bit later than we were yesterday here, so that might work in our favor. <laughs> yeah. All right, first cast, guys. Ready? First cast. Smooth. With any luck, we'll find a kingy, guys. Let's go. I don't want the penalty of not being able to complete this challenge. All right, enough of Joe. Got this bait chunky on. See if we can catch ourselves some snapper for dinner. Oh, Kingy! Kingy, Catherine! Kingy, guys, here we go, here we go! Oh! Two of them! Trying to work them up so they commit to it. Oh no, fouled up! Oh! Oh! 
They haven't been spiked yet. Here we go, here we go. Oh no. They might be gone, damn it. Oh no, here he is. He's right here. Where is he, where is he? Oh. Oh, they're swirling all under it, look at them. I think they've sussed it. That one there is bigger. There's a couple of small ones there, but there's one that doesn't look too bad. Look at them. I think they've sussed it out, unfortunately. Do you need to change, Lewis? Oh, he wanted it. I just got unlucky. So now, they're, now they've figured it out. You reckon stick with that lure and wait for the next pack or swap Lewis? Um, well, we could change Lewis. I mean, we've got more there. I would be quite keen to test that other lure out as well. Yeah, do you want to grab it? Get the bigger one of the, of the shore Spartans. Oh, man. Exciting, though, guys. That's exciting. So that one's going on next, guys. Try one of these other lures and see how they react on that. Hopefully this as well. All right, you are all set. Off you go. All right, let's go. You'll notice I'm just casting really close to me. I'm working just this first 20 meters of water. The kingies are just hunting this ledge right in front of me. So no point in casting way out when the fish are going to be relatively close. So I'm keeping that lure nice and close to me. I can cast my lure into the sea from here and catch a fish. Try it. Mm. It's good, eh? Hey? Yeah, it's good, all right. First cast. Oh, I've got a little snapper. Hopefully he's not too little. <laughs> First cast, Kevin. Wasn't even filming or nothing. <laughs> Need to get a bigger one though. Yeah. George just got one. Oh, thank goodness you caught some dinner. No, not quite legal. Oh no. <laughs> oh, lures off. Oh. All right. There we go, guys. <laughs> no luck on the kingies. We've come back to camp. Little snapper with the trout lure off the beach. <laughs> <laughs> oh. This trout lure rockets out there. Oh, it's wet. Look at that. Boom. You see how far they went? Yeah, it was heaps far. There's like all sorts of fish swimming around in there. We ain't going to film anything. We were just going to go straight into tomorrow's action with the kingies, but... Yeah, this was alright. Catherine started filming. Do you want a dried pear? I'm cool. Catherine didn't catch anything. I didn't see any more kingies. Super slow, man. Might try to get some dinner right now. There's lots of fish swimming around, so... Hmm. You never know, we might have kingies coming here. Eagle ray, guys. Cool. See you later, eh? Bye. Good morning, guys. Nice and early. Catherine's staying back. Goodbye. We're going to take the kingy set up out and try and complete challenge number four. Go cast some bombies. Hopefully tick off challenge number four. So, Joe's gone off. Sun is rising. There's a bit of a boil up just there. Alright guys, we're going to cast these rocks first up, see if there's anything home here this morning. It's starting to rain. Big work up right around us guys. Is there any kingfish home? Big 
car wash. Car wash for belly. It's all I can find, guys. That didn't go to plan, guys. Lots of fish, no kingies. What the heck? Where did we go? No kingies. Oh, no. Gotta put the boat back over here, eh, guys? See a wild dog. Didn't even see one. That's dumb, isn't it? Oh, been waiting for that coffee, Catherine. How's the tea? Lovely. Might be a land based mission again. That seems to be where we're finding all the kingies lately. It'll be good to get out of that wind somewhere. Set our coffee and some breakfast. Now we've got to continue the challenge, eh, Catherine? Yep. Catherine's got a heavy setup as well. She doesn't want to miss out on the kingy action today. No. Down here, guys, that's where we're going. Let's go. Big tide pool down here. How cool is that? That'd be really good for a photo. That's where we should get our photos when we get one, Catherine. Oh, for sure. What are you going to put on? I want to put this one on. That one? Yeah, that one. Catherine's going to put the little shore spartan on, guys. All rigged up, barb squished. I'm ready to go big kingies big kingies today no wasabi okay guys just to spice things up a little bit now i'm the only one that's got the actual reel that this challenge is revolving around but catherine is throwing one of the diver lures if catherine catches a kingfish on that diver lure i lose i have to eat the wasabi good luck we were working as a team, but now we're enemies. Ha! Head to head, me versus Catherine. Spice things up. <laughs> you jumped! <laughs> I got you, didn't I? Well, I turned around to look at you straight away. Your body shook! The thing with Joe, he has nerves of steel. You can't scare him. And if you get this out of him, like the tiniest body movement, then it's a great success. Look how amazing that is. I was fishing in here yesterday. Oh, look, a fish. We saw so many that first night, man. What the heck? Yeah. Oh, yep. Oh, little kingy. Little one. Kingy. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Crazy. Uh, I'll bring it up onto the sled, Jay. Eh? Just watch out, he'll throw the hooks around. Go okay, bales open. Finally found a fish, guys. Jesus. I'll get the lure out. We'll put a tape on them. It's got to be legal size for me to pass this challenge, and that's 75 centimeters. So let's find out. 60. 64? 64. Is that 64? Oh, yeah, 64. Yeah. Oh, 63. 63. 63. <laughs> oh, no. Oh. Oh, while we got them, we might put a tag in them and just let them go, eh? Yep, I'll go get it. Okay, so we've got tag T13684. Tags in. We need to get another one, guys. He's not big enough. We need to get him. I'm, I'm not going to eat the wasabi. <laughs> we need to get his granddaddy. There he goes. Cool. So when he's ready, he'll just swim out this keyhole just here back to the ocean. We could not find a kingy that was over legal. We tried for hours. It's been a huge mission. The crappy thing is, out of all the challenges, I thought I was gonna smoke this one <laughs> because kingy fishing is what I love. Kingy fishing is my jam. So I'm devastated that I couldn't find a big kingy. And now I've got to pay the consequences. <laughs> the funniest thing is, he did catch a kingy, but it was the smallest kingy I have ever seen. Your smallest kingy the whole season. <laughs> I'll just quickly say that reel was super nice to use. The lures went well, it's just the kingies were not on the bite. So guys, we tried to make it happen, but unfortunately, 
it's time for the consequences. Mm -hmm. Oh, just before we do that, if you want to win that reel and the lures that we're using, make sure you comment below and tell us you want to win the reel and the lures. We're going to pick one lucky winner. Hopefully you can catch the fish that Joe did not catch. Exactly. We know you guys are amped up to see a kingy court, so I'm going to do the consequence and then we're going to play some footage from the last trip we did where you will see some kingy action. So Woo! watch me suffer and then watch a nice fish be caught. Could be yours, man. Fully could be yours. I think the squid hat is now also the penalty hat. How much do I have to put on? Is that enough? No, no, that's that's like a quarter of What, a full teaspoon? Yeah, all right. I think that should do. Look at that. Do you want to hold it there? I'm just wondering there. if I do the run into the water again because that was a success. Look at that soft face. <laughs> do you want some water? <laughs> <laughs> I don't recommend that, man. My eyes are running. Can you see them? Yeah, yeah. I do not recommend that. All four of them. <coughs> it takes a couple of seconds to, to fire up. It's been fun making this one, so make sure you give it a like. Tell us what you thought in the comments and enjoy this kingy scene coming up now. Great. She's gnarly out here, guys. We just got out to the ledge. Joe Flood is with us, my brother from Mother Mother. Catherine, also we've got Ash here as well. All right, let's go. Catherine here, she's got her Saltist MQ14000 on a Spartan five to eight rod. And first up, she wants to throw the untamed lures. Hopefully big fish for her. He's coming, Kevin. You got him. Woo -hoo -hoo. Yeah, Catherine. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Oh, yeah, Catherine. You're, going, you're doing good, you're doing real good. Hey Ash, I'll get you to grab this camera in a second when I go to land it. Just watch, he's gonna go again, I reckon. Just oh, pump him up, keep going, get right up. He's going up straight down. Yeah, you're doing good. Ah! Okay, oh, I saw the leader. <laughs> you're doing good. Oh man. Yeah, there he is. Oh, oh shit. Okay. Just keep going right round. I'll keep him away from the rocks. Love it stitchy with a swell. I got him. Okay. Yeah! Oh. Let's go to the rock pool. Oh, man. Good work. Nice. Yay. Good work, Catherine. Yay! Oh. He's good, man. He's a real nice fish. How is that, man? Good work, Catherine. Yeah! Good work. Yeah! <laughs> good on you. Feel how strong he is, hey? Yeah. Oh, they're so pretty, hey? On the untamed low as well, Catherine. Yeah. You, you said you were going to catch a fish I on did. that. I did, that was my goal and it made it happen. Cool. Good work. How many photogs do we need taking photos, eh? Yeah. <laughs> you, go, you go fishing with three professional photographers, you know you're going to end up with a lot of good photos. <laughs> <laughs> so good, eh, Ash? So good. It's so beautiful. Get the lure out. Amazing. Untamed. Woo. 
<laughs> yeah, even just let him go there. Okay, you ready? Yeah, go. Whoosh! There he goes. Bye. Put it there. Yeah! Cool! Good work! Oh. See you on the next one! <laughs> Squidding! Oh, I didn't fall over that. Right. See ya. <laughs>